Welcome to Immunovino Cringe Compilation. Please like and sub for more. Hey! What's up? I'm Raven, your acid bath princess of the darkness. And I'm Tara. And we're sitting here in Tara's room, rocking out to MCR and celebrating 2009 or the new year! Which we don't really understand why people are making such a big deal about it because really, one more year is one more year that everyone's closer to death. Whatever, suit yourself, humanity. Congratulations. Yeah, when you're closer to death. Anyway, so earlier we were listening to AFI, and Tara started talking, and she was like, what do we like, and what do we not like? And all of a sudden we started having this big, like, philosophical conversation about stuff that we like and stuff that we don't like, and we decided that we would share it with all of you guys out there. So we're going to start with what we don't like first. We made a list. Number we don't one. like preps. Or haters. Or haters. Yeah, this falls under a few different categories. Um, some of you out there have been leaving really mean YouTube comments for us, and we really do not appreciate it. So YouTube is a place for people to express their creativism without other people making fun of them. Yeah. So... G Nick 68 and, and Manson, Manson 420. 420. Why are you wasting your time saying all of these mean things when we're just doing what we like and expressing ourselves and what we have that's deep within us that some people, most people, don't understand? And I would really wish that you would just stop hating on goths everywhere. That's not cool. What if people started hating on you? Yeah, Manson 420. What if everyone started hating on you? Or G Nigged 68? What if. What everyone... kind of name is that anyway? Yeah. G Nigged. Hey guys, Schmini here. So, basically, I'm just making this video to tell you all that you've put me through so much. And, um, I hate the world. I hate everyone. I hate you all. I, I think I just, you know. I'm finally transitioning into my self. And like, that's all that matters because, like, this world sucks and the government is trying to ruin us. So, like, I might just like kill myself or something. And like, Yeah, because, like, I think I'm emo now. I think it's like, don't judge me on my preference of, like, music. Don't judge me on my dressing style because I'm emo now. Shut the fuck up! Lady Gaga is a whore! A fucking whore. A freaking copy machine of the fucking 80s. You people don't see this or what? It's like so fucking obvious. Duh. People, wake up and smell the black coffee, please. You take Marilyn Manson, David Bowie, Grace Jones, mix it all together in one big fat choppy blender, a blender which I wish whole world would fall in and destroy it, like grind it into little pieces so that all humanity would be purified of all this fucking bullshit, all the bullshit you always have against me. And that includes Lady Gaga, because Lady Gaga is a whore. She's just trying to get attention and she's even succeeding and all you stupid fucking sheeps are so fucking blind to see it. I mean, jeez. Wearing her little lightning bolt, David Bowie. Wearing her weird ass, like, Borka thing. That's from the Muslims, bitch! It's like, oh my god! Lady Gaga, she's so new and innovative! No, she's fucking not, okay? Get over it, she's old news. I don't understand why you people all love her so much. Cause she's a whore. A fucking whore. Wake up, people. A whore. There. I rest my fucking case. And I'm making this video 
black. See you, fuckers. What's up, guys? Shadowcat911 here, and I thought I would tell you right now I'm going through some changes. Not a lot. Not weird changes. Nope. Nope. Ew. Deal. Gross. Get out of here. Please. Um, if you noticed, I look a lot darker. Yes, I'm wearing a choker. I own a choker. I have for a while. I love my choker. Also, yeah, if you noticed, I'm wearing eyeliner. I have my hair on my face. I'm being myself. This is who I am, guys. I'm emo. Yep. Dying my hair black soon. Finally got my mom's permission to. I'm trying to look, convince her to let me do the tips blue. I'm getting my black eyeshadow finally. My eyeliner. I already have. I have everything I need, pretty much. Going to Hot Topic soon. Picking up my new clothing, which I'm super happy for. Because I hate shopping at Justice and Target. And honestly, this is who I am. So you can freaking deal with it. If you don't want me to be who I am, then get off this channel. If you don't support emo, then guess you don't support me. Okay, this is a video because of all of the stupid hate videos we've seen about emo kids. We were getting really pissed off about it. We were screaming at the fucking computer. That is how pissed we were. Because you guys, like, you people who make the videos, you guys have no clue what goes on in our lives. So you can't say that like, emo kids are just people who wear black and wear eyeliner and get depressed. And don't act like we're emotionless. Emo is short for we're emotional. Emotion. Yeah. Emotional. We, we're highly sensitive. Like, emo kids are highly sensitive, okay? They're not afraid to cry. A lot of people can't cry. I know I can't, I can't cry in front of people. Because in my family, that shows weakness. You show weakness in my family, you're going to be hearing about it for the next six months. And for and for all you know, how do you know that there's not, like, not something going on in their lives that are making them depressed? Yeah, they could be you don't bother. You don't bother going up to them and asking them what's wrong. So next time, you want to tell some shit and say that, oh, all emos are just faking it. Why don't you ask one? Why don't you ask them why they're sad? Why don't you ask them? Because you, for all you know, their best friend could have just committed suicide. For all you know, their parents could have just walked out on them. For all you know, their best friend could have died because of drugs or, or or anything. Shit happens, okay? It doesn't just happen to normal kids. It, normal. Normal doesn't even exist, okay? Get that get, out of your head. Get that it, through your thick fucking skull. What? Oh, God, why? Twerking for the dead homies. No! Oh, my God! No! Oh. Where that 40 at? Pour out a little liquor for the dead homies. One for the dead homies. <laughs> One for me. One for the dead homie. No! Hard to say goodbye to yesterday. Too soon, no. This one's for the dead homies. Oh, <laughs> why? <laughs> Gone, but not forgotten. <laughs> hey guys, it's Miguel Rar and. This is a rant video. Um, it's something I've been wanting to get out of my chest, but I haven't. And I came to the point where I just can't take it anymore. And I just have to talk about it. Um, and what that topic is, um, old scene kids and new scene kids or whatever. 
But what pisses me off is how old scene kids like nowadays are like, oh my god, fuck scene kids, blah 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 blah. It's like, um, excuse you, have you seen yourself like not even a year ago? You were freaking like so try hard or you were one of the scene kids and now you're trying to bash on them because I actually find it adorable like seeing these little scene kids around and whatnot. Like I actually like it. I don't believe scene is dead and ever will be because there's always gonna be that at least one person out there who probably is still seen or has the scene style. Like even I now, like people still call me scene, but I honestly don't care because people a lot of people say scene's dead and obviously if people are calling me scene, it only like it just means that I'm still the same and I haven't changed. Yeah, dude, I gotta get that new CD, like, oh Whoa, what are you doing? Oh my god, guys, yeah. what's up? Not much, just come and get the new oh my god. CD, like, oh my god. I expect you to be I here. just, like, have to have it. Like, let's go look for it. Let's go, come on. Let's go, guys. <laughs> Found it. Oh my I god. Found it. Oh my god. Warp Toy. Oh. Greatest hits. <laughs> 303. Oh Oh my god, I fall out oh boy. Fall out boy. What? Like, geez, no. Yes. No. Yes, fall no. Oh Wait, wait, wait. Oh my god. I love Walmart. I love Walmart. Oh my god, like, should we get it? Should we buy it? Oh my god. Dude, let's fucking buy it. Oh my god. Let's fucking buy it. Dude, let's fucking buy it. Dude, let's fucking buy it. We need to, like, buy this and get some, like, candles so we can, like, listen to it in our room and, like, like, candles. Oh my god. What if we cry? What if we cry? <gasps> Justin Bieber! <laughs> oh my god, that little boy just makes me want to jizz Justin myself. Justin Bieber makes like, my oh my god, he want, tingle. He makes me want to just like jizz all over. Like, oh. <laughs> let's go this again. Okay, let's go. Let's see what other stuff we can find. Like, how are your wrists coming up from those last cuts you gave yourself? Well, I just cut myself five minutes ago. Really? Let me see. Look at it. Ah. Tastes good. Oh, I want this one. I want this one. I want this oh one. God. It's cute. It's cute. It's, it's hot pink. Hot pink. My color. Wait, 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 Torn. That one. It's like hot the pink. It's cute. Go shopping. Oh my god, let's go to the girl clothes. <gasps> I love that. Do you think they have to move in your size? <laughs> no, it's all too big. Oh my, oh my god. Damn it, I don't know what skinny jeans are these days. Look at these. Look at these. Oh my god. Look at these. <laughs> Look at these. Oh my god. Dude, Look try them on. Dude, dude, I do fucking try them on. Oh, I don't know. Oh Come on, Just do it. Oh, do it. Crazy. It'll make your feet look so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> really sexy.